Hello my beautiful soul, welcome to a new reading. Let's see what is the message meant to reach you right in this moment. It is a timeless reading as you know, so whenever it finds you, it is for you. Also, we're going to pick up now the zodiac signs for this specific reading. So let's see who is here. And we have a Libra. Maybe I will place here for the moment. We have Capricorn. Also Aquarius. Oop. And one more. Scorpio. All right. So either you are a Libra, a Capricorn, Aquarius or Scorpio. For you is this reading. So how I'm going to do? I'm going to use the tea leaves. I haven't used them in a while. And let's see. Message for you. I will pick up three tea leaves. Two and one more. All right. Let's put them on the side here. We have this beautiful um, oracle deck also will give us more insight, more advice for you, my beautiful soul, in regards of um, this important message that you need to know right now. All right. Learn from your mistakes. This is what uh, it says at the bottom of the deck. I will put it here so I can see it. I feel like there is for someone here an, uh, an important uh, message. Let's see. So we have arrow. You are on the right path regarding some aspects of your life. Interesting. And just for a moment, I want to uh, make sure of something here. Just a moment. All right. Someone might... Hmm. Either you get inspired by someone or you are the, you will inspire someone with your determination as you are on a path here. Let's see next. We are going to put all together. I have the tarot here also. Okay. We have the fan, romance, celebration and party. And I have my phone here. Mm-hmm because I want to make sure that my Spanish is good. So like-minded people and with the fan here, a celebration, um, a reunion here, a party. Yes, with like-minded people. Let's see what is next. Mm -hmm. And both. Let me translate that also. I want to make sure that I'm seeing the, the I'm seeing the right thing or doesn't want for some reason. Uh-huh. All right. Now some of you here you are going to win something. Now how important it is to learn from each experience that you go through uh, right now or in the next period of time, every challenge in your life is coming in for a reason. All right. So don't let anything just pass by you. For some reason here, um, you, you are actually the reason is very clear. You are about to inherit something, to win something. A great change is coming towards you. So you are doing the right thing. You are going to be surrounded by like-minded people, as we see here, great celebration. So if you, uh, not yet, you don't see these positive aspects of your um, situation, you will see. You remember you had this... Um, card saying to learn from your mistakes and here is telling you also that 
you know, everything happens for a reason. So when something um, challenging appears in your life, take it as a lesson, make the best out of it. You are on the right track here. That's uh, the most important message that you need to know right in this moment. You will celebrate, you will be happy, you will be victorious here. You are uh, stepping into a new into a new phase here, a new community, a new company. Bottom of the deck, stability. This is the four of pentacles showing that uh, uh, if stability is what you are aiming for, you are going to get this. So don't you worry. Everything is um, going or working for you. Is nothing against you. And when you feel that something might it, it feels like against you is actually uh, important. There is a lesson that you need to learn. Now, let's see a little bit with um, the tarot. So, we have the judgment card. Now, the judgment card here shows that you see, whatever this new path is for you requires a change. The judgment card can be a second chance, right, for you. So you cannot do, I always say this, you cannot do the same old thing and expect different results. Either is work, either is your love life. You cannot choose the same type of a person and expect a different outcome. So a necessary change. The judgment card is also uh, the wake up call, right? Um, it's it's that wake up call that uh, you you need to answer to in this moment. All right. So a necessary change in your attitude in whatever um, you are doing, all right? So we have the Queen of Wands. Queen of Wands, she can get whatever she wants. You have the ability to attract in your life whatever you want the most. But to get there, you need to make some changes. Be open to the change. Embrace the unknown. Um, do something different. You also have the moon. Now with the moon here, you will discover maybe that you've been afraid of something that you should not have been. Maybe you are afraid of change. You are afraid of, um, you know how some people, I got, let me, let me tell you what I felt instantly. Um, sometimes some people um, are are finding themselves in certain groups or with certain, you know, surrounded by certain people that are at a, not at the same level, you know, intellectually, um, uh, you know what I mean? So if you want to get better, if you want to win, if you want to reach your goals, you must be surrounded by the right people, like-minded people. So if you have in your life people that don't want to evolve, that don't want to expand, that don't want more from life, that are comfortable with, you know, they settle for whatever comes up and that's it. That's not for you. All right. So pay attention to this, to who is around you. I'm not saying now stop talking with people, but be careful. Um, let's say, um, with who you advise yourself, right? From who you look for advice, um, because you might ask the wrong person. Uh, don't ask someone, maybe you want to, to move uh, to a totally new uh, company or department, and you might ask someone who never did such a change that would never make such a move. So this is what I'm trying to to, to tell you here. That's why it's so important to surround yourself with like-minded people. Now, your next card here 
is the two of wands. You see, planning. Two of wands is the card of planning. So look um, in front of you. You are on the right path. Some small or big adjustments depends where you are at in your life right now in regards maybe of the people that surround you in regards of certain behaviors that you have the thing is you have to keep moving don't stop because you are on the uh, right path here and um you know, the high priestess and you should not let anyone anything to stop you now if anyone feels as a blockage um, detach yourself from because you need to move forward you are here um, I feel like a little bit hold into a place by um, either someone or I don't know certain circumstances that it is in your power to to change the high priestess definitely uh, coming up here uh, reminding you that everything that happens to you, um, if, if, if it's challenging is a lesson. So take it and use it as you move forward towards your goal, learn from your mistakes and adjust your plans. So if you already have certain plans and something goes off, that doesn't mean you have to give up reevaluate the judgment this is showing you that you are on the right path that but you might need to uh, make some adjustments so be open to make um to make changes two of swords here a decision must be taken and is an interesting two of swords right she's not uh, protecting herself the swords are up and i get the feeling like i know what i've got to do right is a person who is um not afraid of what is in front and definitely here is a victory is a success for you remember you are on the right path my beautiful soul this is what i get for you in this moment thank you so much for being here with me please don't forget to give a like to this video to subscribe to comment turn on that notification bell um just like you to know when i come up with a new reading for you thank you so much and i wish you all the best Love and light.